Hey there guys, in this video I'm going to teach you how to gather information using the DNS Recon tool. In last video we have seen how to gather information using the DNS Enum, which I don't like the tool. So I just want to share with you how to gather information using the DNS Recon. Before that I have already wrote a blog post on DNS Recon. The blog post link is in the description, do go and check it out. So the DNS Recon stands for Domain Name Service Reconnaissance and I have given who developed the tool and uh, the download link on the github pages the dns recon can gather information such as the name records and all the possible uh, dns records such as the mx soa mx is nothing but the mail records n is his name record name servers and um, the a ipv4 and the 4a is ipv6 address spf address uh, records sorry spf records and even the text records and even the tool is doing srv record enumeration and uh, the tool is also doing um, brute forcing on possible subdomains found and i have wrote the dns recon useful commands and let's see Quickly, let's see the example one. In example one, what we are doing is doing a standard scan and re, uh, DNS recon. To do a standard scan, just enter dash D and the tag it. So before that, I will show you how to download the DNS recon. Just enter sudo apt get install DNS recon. So this is how to install DNS recon. I have already installed in my system. So to do a standard scan, just enter DNS recon dash D the target here will be mine my domain so the uh, in standard scan you could gather information such as the mail records so here there is no mail records and the ipv4 address ipv6 and also it is doing an enumeration srv records and the soa name servers okay so this is how to perform a standard scan in dns recon let's see the example 2 example 2 we are doing a specific uh, recon in a specific search engine the su specific search engine here is dash b and dash y so if you have any doubt with uh, uh, what kind of uh, search engines this uh, tool can support just enter the dns uh, recon dash dash help and as you could see here a little bit up so it is saying that perform Bing enumeration, Yandex enumeration, the dash K for the certificate.sh. We have already talked about the certificate.sh and let's do this Bing and Y. Let's do it with the uh, Bing enumeration and even the certificate.sh. So DNS uh, recon dash B and dash K. K is for the certificate.sh and the target here will be for the target you should just enter dash d and the target here is let's enter kali dot org give enter so it says performing enumeration of a domain so it's taking time so this is how to perform a dns recon on specific search engines so this tool is supporting the bing uh, and the dash y and x and crt.sh even the who is record who is record, uh, records so let's wait after the enumerating a survey record it will search for either bing or the certificate.sh so now what let's give control uh, control c and exit it and uh, i'm going to enter my own domain Kali, Kali domain is very much it's a big uh, site so mine is a small site so I'm just going to enter techerec.com which will finish in like within a minute so it says that it's a problem okay just try with your own Kali mission you can enter the target but use it for legal purposes so let's see the example 3 so this is how to perform a specific search engine uh, searches let's see the example 3 in example 3 we are doing a reverse lookup so to do reverse lookup just enter the dash r and uh, so dns recon dash d take it with dot 
call and dash r for the reverse lookup the reverse lookup um, I've already done it let's copy this paste it in here 168 I guess let's copy it paste it in here so it says range provided is not valid so let's go with the ipv sorry I, I just entered the soi records i didn't go with the ipv4 records let's just take this address and let's enter the ipv4 address 79 Let's paste it in here. Let's give enter. So this, as you could see, the reverse lookup of the range, it started to performing reverse lookup from the 104.21.31.172.172.67.178.241. So this is how to do a reverse lookup in DNS recon tool. Let me do just control C and exit it. You just try with your Kali machines okay let's see the next example the next example we are doing a brute forcing on the target domain so do it for legal purpose don't do it for any legal activities so dns um, recon dash d target area is thickyrec.com and dash capital d is for the uh, it is saying that dictionary dictionary attack so always the password directory is slash user slash share just remember this okay word list slash metasploit slash unix password so here the file is unix password if you already have a set of password uh, with the file just enter the, the directory and the file name and uh, dash t brt stands for the brood and um, that's it and uh, let us add the v dash v also uh, dash v is for the verbosity so let's give enter so it says that slash use uh, okay okay it says that the directory doesn't exist so let's search for a uh, search whether the directory exists or not let's send um, cd slash usr slash shari slash wordless slash metasploit let's give it this yes it's my mistake I forgot to enter the S. So as Linux is case and still you will make uh, guys like me also make mistakes. So over here I didn't enter the S. So as you could see here, Unix uh, where it is. Yeah, here it is here. Unix password. So S is here. I didn't just en I I didn't enter the S. So let's give enter now. So it says performing host and subdomain brute force. So as you could see, it is doing a possible subdomain uh, brute forcing. It's saying Raspberry. Let's take it dot com. So it's doing with various passwords. Let's close this terminal and let's see other example. So this is how to perform uh, brute forcing on uh, subdomains uh, using the DNS recon tool. In example 5 we are just doing a zone working which is very simple let's give ctrl c and exit it zone working dns recon dash t techrec.com dash t zone work give enter so it says performing zone work you just try with your 
machine. I'm going to give control C and exit it. What just happened? Okay, let's wait it. So the final example is we are just saving the uh, saving the uh, brute forcing in XML format. Pretty much very easy. So soon could not be walk so but this is how to perform a zone walk as it said the performing zone walk this is how to perform it didn't perform the zone walk because uh, there are some restrictions in my domain you could try with your own domain or the target domain you want whatever okay dash v dot xml uh, dot x dash xml and the file name is text.xml so it says there's some problem okay so it's i think it's dash dash xml So it started to perform the brute forcing and let's give control C and the file name should exist in uh, text.xml format. So oh, it is over here. Let's give cat text.xml. So it's in XML format. So this is how to save a file and uh, dns recon you could also try with your standard scan the standard scan and dns recon is uh, dns recon dash d and the target okay so you could also save in a standard scan okay so this is how to you this is how to gather information using the dns recon tool so if you really like this video make sure you give a like and subscribe to our channel so see you next video guys